Welcome to Open BXRX on BronxNet. I'm your host, Sanji Lopez, inviting you to get social with us at BronxNet TV on Instagram and Twitter and BronxNet Community Television on Facebook. Montefiore Health System recently launched its new robotic joint replacement program. And it's one of the first programs in the area to utilize the new surgical robot called ROSA which stands for Robotic Surgical Assistant. Joining us now to share more is Dr. Carlos Alvarado, Director of Robotic Hip and Knee Surgery at Montefiore Health System. Welcome, doctor. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having me. So first to start, can you tell us about Montefiore Orthopedics and specifically the Robotic Joint Replacement Program? Sure. So Montefiore Orthopedics is a big multi-specialty orthopedic group where we treat everybody in every orthopedic issue. We have a long history, uh, you know, here in the community. Um, and then as far as joint replacement, it's something that we've been doing um, for over three decades. Um, and one of the busiest joint replacement centers here in the area. Uh, as far as um, the robotics are concerned, it's a very new program and uh, something that I'm spearheading for the organization. Thank you, doctor. And you are one of the newest doctors at Montefiore. Can you tell us about yourself and your specializations? Sure, sure. So as I said, my name is Carlos Miguel Alvarado. I was actually born in Mexico. I immigrated to the United States with my parents when I was pretty young um, and trained all over the United States. Uh, most relevant to us is my orthopedic training here in New York, actually at Hospital for Joint Diseases. And then uh, my fellowship program up at Harvard, where I was there for a year, where I actually met my wife, who is also an orthopedic surgeon here at Montefiore. From my adult reconstructive training program at Harvard, I went actually down to Miami. It was important to me to work in a Latin American community. I was in Miami for the last seven years, doing hip and knee replacement. I actually started a robotics program down there as well. You know, after time in Miami, it was time to come back home close to family. And, and like I said, my wife is from the area. So we, you know, coming to Montefiore was actually coming home for us. And, uh, and you know, I've been here now, you know, several months. Uh, but in that short time, we've been able to do big things. And uh, it was important to get this robotics uh, program on the ground. And we've hit it running. Wow. And one of those big things, doctor, is your new partner named Rosa, the robotic surgical assistant. Can you tell us more about this surgical robot and what types of things she can do? Sure. So Rosa is our newest member of the orthopedic team. Um, you know, robotic surgery is not new to orthopedics. It's something I've been doing for the last six years, and it's actually something we've been experimenting with in the orthopedic world for the last decade or so. The interesting and exciting thing about Rosa is that with this particular robot, we can do our three-dimensional planning and mapping without the use of CT scan or MRI. Historically, and all of the other robots require CT scan or MRI, um, which is, it's a great study, but it's expensive, it's time consuming. And for certain patient populations, it's not an option, okay? So for, for patients that either don't have the insurance to pay for it, or don't have access to that type of equipment, you know, it basically blocks them out from using this robotic technology. The robot has already demonstrated to be more accurate and more precise and can position the actual implants for knee and hip replacements with more accuracy. So that in turn uh, has the potential to benefit patients at um, decreased complications and decreased revision rates. So what ROSTA gives us is the ability to bring this technology to our patients without having to worry about insurance status, without having to worry about, you know, are we going to be able to schedule this, uh, you know, this expensive study? And, and it allows us to um, basically, you know, use this robotic technology to improve accuracy uh, regardless of you know, patient background, regardless of insurance status. So it's a powerful tool for our patient population and uh, something that I'm really excited to be working with. Sounds exciting and cost-effective. One-stop shop, Rosa, um, will be available at Mount Um That's So right. people may you know, be curious about it and the doctor will be happy to explain, you know, this is my new assistant and this is what she can do. Um, sure. I also, I'm very curious to ask, doctor, how has COVID-19 impacted orthopedic surgeries, especially here in the Bronx? So it's, it's been a 
a big impact, just like everybody. You know, we, we've, we've seen the impact in the hospital at large. And us as orthopedic surgeons, um, you know, we've, we've had to dial back uh, our elective procedures. So hips and knee replacements is something called an elective procedure. It means that we do them for quality of life, to try to make your life better, make you more comfortable, more effective, more functional, and happier. That being said, sometimes things happen and we need to put on a different hat. And many people in the department have had to, you know, put our passions and, and kind of our areas of specialty on hold for the greater good and gone kind of transitioned over to helping out on COVID floors. I know our residents were a huge help in that aspect. Several of our attending physicians were a huge help in that aspect and really just trying to care for the community and, and the crisis as it came up. Now that we're kind of transitioning over into this life with COVID as opposed to just dealing with COVID, but trying to really develop some type of normalcy, and we're still affected in the sense that we need to be vigilant, okay? And that means that we're doing our, our hip and knee replacements, we're doing our elective procedures when it's appropriate, um, but every patient, when they're considered for an elective surgery, they're screened uh, and then they're tested. And if necessary, then we do a, um, you know, we ask them to quarantine uh, for an appropriate amount of time. Um, and with that, we've been able to identify asymptomatic patients and notify them of their diagnosis, but also we've been able to proceed with our elective procedures, you know, our life-changing procedures in a, in a safe, safe way. And about telemedicine, doctor, um, that's one of the new alternatives. Well, it's not entirely new, but it's something that's been popular during the, you know, the pandemic. Um, speaking of that, how has Montefiore Orthopedics Department continued to support their patients in preparation for these surgeries that are coming up? Yeah. So telemedicine is not something that we did all that often a year and a half ago. It's now on the front of everyone's mind because it's a safe way to deliver care in times like this. And we've actually started with something called a virtual urgent care. And what that means is that you can see an orthopedic surgeon on the same day of any issue, all you have to do is call us at our, uh, at our, our available phone number, tell them you wanna be seen in the virtual urgent care, and we will uh, set up a same day uh, virtual visit, uh, video or just telephone if you don't have access to a smartphone. Um, and the other thing that we've established is just our going forward, any appointment that you have with me or any of our providers can be a televisit or a virtual visit. All you have to do is let the schedulers know that you prefer to do that. Um, we have, uh, we're hoping to expand our virtual urgent care, but at the same time, I'm also hoping to get back to normal and seeing my patients face to face so I can give them hugs like we used to. Yeah, I can imagine they miss you. You must so yeah, safely with the mask on and everything, of course. <laughs> um, doctor, how can people find out more about Rosa and inquire about surgeries and contact Montefiore at this time? What is that number for the telemedicine if somebody's tuning in? So it's uh, much like Rosa's our one-stop shop robot. We have a one-stop shop number, 718-920-2060. This is a 24 seven answering service for Montefiore Orthopedics Department. You can reach any of our providers, including myself, and also uh, establish a virtual urgent care uh, appointment just by asking. And once again, there's always a live person at the other end of that phone. And uh, all you have to do is ask. If you want to speak directly to one of the providers, um, you just tell them. They actually send us a message right then. It'll show up on our phones, believe it or not. We get a text message, and then we'll call you back directly. Sounds wonderful. Thank you so much, Dr. Carlos Alvarado. Dr. Alvarado is the Director of Robotic Hip and Knee Surgery at Montefiore Health System. Thank you again. Thank you. My pleasure. Again, folks, for general questions and appointments on Montefiore Orthopedics, you can call Montefiore Health System at 718-920-2060. We'll be right back.